G'day, today we're going to have a look at level 29 in the Editor's Bulletin DLC of Train Valley 2. This one's called Bucky Balls. We have 18 minutes, we have to avoid train crashes, and we can't destroy objects worth more than 220,000. Okay, so we have, it's my first look at this one, and we have workers here and there. This guy needs 12, that guy needs 14 and 7. Um, this guy also needs those 7 too. So it suggests that these 12 are the first things we want to worry about, which are going to be here, which are gold and diamonds. We get diamonds from the ore down here. We've got 45,000 to start with. Um, where are we in the diamond? The gold's from down here. So we really need both of these guys heading down this way. The diamonds have to come through this gate. So let's start by putting this connection. We also have letters too, so what have we got? We've got C, D, and B. And then I can see that we've got at least one side up here we need to work on. We do probably want to get onto those quick too to make some quick money. So let's make sure they're connected. He only has to face that way for now. Let's do that. Well, he certainly doesn't need to go in there so he doesn't have to face the other way. We have 18,000 left. There's a tunnel there. Which gets us to electricity. So that's just a pure electricity connection up that way. Um, and let's go... Straight that way. We'll cut through there. I'm not going to make it to either of those. Let's um, restart, <laughs> and we'll go just this guy. Straight up, um, we'll just look at him slightly. thousand left at this point so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hit plus on this and send a whole bunch of guys from this end and basically we're just gonna do this until I've got enough money that we can build lines for the other two guys well, they're gonna make me have to swap back and forth for all of these Okay, so that's workers arrived. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get guys connected to things um, because the idea is going to be <clears throat> that we want to get um, just these caps removed so that we're generating workers uh, just in case our problem is going to be that we don't have enough workers. I don't feel like we've made that much money from this exercise. set up here sort of the idea I had 
So what we're holding out for is just this guy here to get out of the way. Uh, we've still got 43,000. And what we can do while we're just no longer working on this part of the road is we can um, just quickly shift some guys over to gold. that needed for that's needed for these vortex things we need 14 of those so let's flick him up this way that's got 12 which we do need for the initial um but here So I'm gonna send workers down here because I want to see what how long this um, gate goes for. Basically, the question that we're wanting to answer. Of course, as soon as I do that, I've got a um, a train that needs to cut through. So maybe let's flip this up. Yep, it's got to go that way, so I can send this guy through. That I suppose now <clears throat> what's going to happen is we're going to have to pay like 50,000 to get guys to cut through. We needed to sort of move guys in an emergency. Oh, that only holds seven. Okay. Okay, so move these guys down here send these guys down this way to there these trains when we go to C, so like we're not rushing this now, but um, at least sort of keep them moving. Gotta get through to here as well.
this exercise we're going to need some of this ore made too. six there. We'll get this guy down here. Is that going to open again for me? There we go. Alright, we've got six uh, pass-throughs this time. So. We've probably put that in a bad place. Um, so what I'm going to do is with that guy now gone, I'm going to bulldoze that connection. We'll put this guy basically exactly where he hits. Do that before you need to delete this back end of that. Um, and then run this guy up to there. We also just need to get... So that's our 200,000 that we need, so we can't get electricity until we've got a ton of money. Okay. So next, let's move the two of these guys. Let's um, get the next two trains as well. Bring that guy, and then hit that one. So that's all the trains. Um, so we've got now no onus on uh, needing to get those moving. Send workers over to the polymers that we need for... for I don't even know. It's, okay, the um, wire. Oh, we've got to buy that for the copper bars. Okay. Now the question is whether that's wasted too much time early without sort of that initial establishment. I've definitely had that problem uh, in levels before where I've not, I've sort of relied too heavily on just getting rid of letters um, that I'm not properly prepared for the rest of the time uh, that I need to spend. send the um, diamonds all the way around. some of these other guys and we'll get rid of the last piece. So that A is going to go that way. This guy, same thing. He's just going to shoot all the way through. Go the same way, which is just going to leave that um, C at the very top for now. Um, <clears throat> so what we now want to do is start looking at getting our next round of things ready to go. Let's pay the 20000 for that. This guy only needs to go to C, so it means that we can actually demolish everything to these guys. That one I didn't actually, I needed to keep that for electricity. Um, get rid of all of that. Don't know if I want to pay for the electricity yet. It does seem I'm a bit limited. Um, the upgrading to level seven trains, um, knowing that I have to spend 200,000. I went the wrong way. What am I allowed to do? Just avoid train crashes. Okay, so we can just stop that guy. 
flip him. And that guy pause that guy. Very good. Uh, we'll send that guy up there too, just because this is going to be the way we max out these things with 14. Um... So let's just bite the bullet with this one. Yes, yeah, so electricity is now on the network. Um, okay. So we want to get guys down here, and I feel like this is where we need... We have an argument for upgrading trains. Because I need 14 guys, say, down here. And I would take me three lots of this to, to get through. So um, what I'm going to do is use seven seater trains to get us all the way down there. I am going to demolish. No, I need to keep that track. Still got that one train to go. So we're going to hold on to that for now. Um, still working on that. So I feel like in the meantime, we can start to send workers somewhere. Send these guys up here. And we need definitely need more of this. Um, So quickly, let's just get these guys out of the way. We'll use the two seven seaters just to make them move quick. <laughs> okay, then we'll get this guy to head up and do more gold. Uh, and then we'll just send the remainder of what he's got up that way too. down here. It does feel like we're really at the mercy of um, this gate being open again. Get those guys all down there. Uh, I'm then going to take a seven seater train. I'll run these guys down into here. about to go. So this is where we're going to use our seven seater trains. As soon as it's ready. No rush. Um, well, we'll take that seven seater train and we'll run the second lot of guys down here. That's good to go. I'm going to buy a third seven seater train. Drop this guy down. Get him in here. Uh, and then we'll take... The other one did the same thing. Then gonna jump down here, take seven polymers. We're gonna run them over to the wire. Also need getting this guy through. Just to clear him out of the way. He could have been a seven seater train, but we've ended up with a six. Okay, polymer's gone through there. Um, so we need 14 of this up the top here.
that guy now connected, we're gonna delete that. Um, we can then swap to this guy and say that we want seven of this four in the same spot. We can now take the 12 of these and deliver them. Another seven seat up and send these guys up there as well. Um, we also then are going to need, I think, 12 more of these because we're going to need another 12 coal beyond this. Or another 14 coal. So we'll send two guys through here to flip that switch again. No, not that guy. Stop him, flip him around. Uh, we'll take 7 seat up and send this guy up. All the way to there. And we'll take this seven seater and send that guy down there. Okay. So I'm not fire those guys as well. So everyone's now a seven seater, so we don't have to stress about who's where. Um, I was going to deliver this guy straight to the gems because it's needed, but I realize that the guys down here are way more important to get loaded up, and we're about to lose. Um, those workers as an option for a little while again. So we're going to send 14 guys down to uh, the copper ore because we are going to need another 14 for this gold. Then going to take the 14 gold here. Send that down this way. guys from here and send them down this way as well but there's a break while we build more guys so we're gonna send some of these bars down to get delivered down here we also have a problem that this um, coal won't start generating until we get those diamonds out of here and we have to send those diamonds um, through that gate um, okay so that 14 is still going so what we can do is we can send these guys down this way um, send workers from here down just to the same task two guys up so they're gonna crash this should be okay yeah never so slightly great so then what we can do is we can take this guy and we can say get out of there and we can just go have him sit up at the gate ready to go and that'll at least get um them started i also need to get diamonds over here uh, this is also clear, which means that this guy can come down and get delivered over there as well. These guys can get delivered over here. Alright, that's ready to go. So, we're going to send him down this way, and we'll send the second one along this way as well. Then, um, what we need to do is send these guys down here. We have the polymers that need to get over here. And the question is, do we need to send them through the gate? So I'm going to have two lots of diamonds that are going to have to go this way. 
and then it would just be anything else that may need to go through the gate. So because I've got so much money, I'm going to send polymers this way. Just in case I need the gate for something I'm not currently seeing. Um, okay, so these guys will send up this way. Add that extra piece of road we haven't yet had. Him down there, follow him up with this guy. Then we're going to send these seven guys up that way. Get this wire out of there and they're going to go up to the same place. Okay, then what we need is this guy to get over here. We need this guy to go to the same place. Then we can take guys from here and send them into uh, jewelry. Take the. Okay, so we've got what, three and a half minutes at this point, so it does feel like we're going to be pretty close. Once this guy's through, then we're going to get the um, wire through. there. I'm going to send these as a group of four because um, may as well just not have that stop just in case uh, they're more efficient than the, the gold is. Yeah, that guy can go and then as soon as this hits seven we can send him across. We have two and a half minutes. There's our seven. Now this guy doesn't actually have to go around the top. So if I want to save money, I could send this guy along the bottom. So why not? I think that guy's going to have 14 ready to go before he's um, he arrives. This guy, I'm not going to get to arrive, I'm just going to get him to wait closer. It's pretty good, we've got a minute and a half or so. Let's just, just don't crash and then that one's... Just don't spend too much money. Game time, okay, real time, pretty solid, funds, um, pretty good too. Any uh, questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below, and until next time, catch you later. See ya.